What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Most Bone. So first things first, first things first, first things first, let's talk about how I showed you guys how to make MT. You guys should have seen that yesterday. This is so you can get the Giannis that I'm about to show you guys today. Not everything sold, but you guys can see that the contracts sell easily, easily, easily. That's my favorite way to make MT. Now today we're here to talk about the one and only Greek freak. Power forward, small forward, 6'11 from Greece. There's honestly not much I have to say. You guys can see for yourself the Hall of Fame badges, quick first step, downhill, fancy footwork, contact finisher, relentless. Bro, you guys probably know everything this dude has, the defensive stuff, the pogo sticks. My dude's got Hall of Fame clamps, bro. He's got dimer, pickpocket, floor general, all gold defensive leader. He's honestly one of those guys that you just can't stop he's got quick draw all that so his threes is 79 but it's pretty consistent i'll be hitting it his jump shot is smooth same as every year pretty much a little faster just slightly not much but anyway you guys can see the stats you guys know everything that this dude is about the ball handling's an 86 very very important you guys see the defense the 92 steal the perimeter the interior dude can rebound dude is fast and when i say dude is fast i mean dude is fast dude is lightning speed so we're gonna take a look at some of his animations we know he's very cheesy so last year the main animation that was the best honestly when i had that galaxy opal Giannis, was the euro the euro this year isn't as op especially that you get caught in the defender i think they did it that way because of how overpowered it was last year but they obviously made another move that's just as overpowered and it's sad because I really miss the Euro dunk especially with Giannis. You can't even really do a Euro dunk anymore. You can try, it doesn't really work, especially like with the defense setup, it's not really gonna happen. So we're gonna be talking about the new overpowered move just a little bit just to see his animation with it and that's honestly this overpowered move right here little hop step whether you want to go up with the dunk with the layup but honestly the hop step this year is so overpowered especially with a player like Giannis everybody does it you guys are gonna run into it pretty much every play people just hop step left and right it's hard to steal last year i really liked to spin the spin move was really really fun but this year that's not even a part of the game like you spin you're losing the ball 100 percent. so this year you need to learn how to hop step how to do anything that you can do and honestly this Giannis can do pretty much anything he's fast he can dribble from anywhere and he can take it to the rim in any way possible and he's pretty much unstoppable because look where he could dunk from he could do pretty much any animation and that's why this card is worth it you guys are asking me is he worth all the MT and my answer is yes you are gonna sell everything back make sure you do that don't lock anything in you don't want to do that at all if you lock stuff in that is not the move you're gonna be wasting a lot of MT these cards will go down eventually maybe not not like crazy but eventually one day they're not gonna be worth it so make sure you sell when you can we're gonna take a look at his jump shot I do have the shot meter on which isn't good shot meter off actually makes me green a lot more I do green with his jump shot because it is pretty much similar to last year's and I did use the other Giannis a lot remember that so what is so good about Giannis one his length right so that is the most important honestly look at how long he is you can like like pause please pause 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 but look how long he is look at the grounds he covers he can run from one side of the court to the other without any issues he's a great defender he's got glitchy animations he can dunk from the right side left side wherever side you want from anywhere literally i can click anything at any time i'm gonna take you guys to a game in a second might be running some triple threat online just for fun but honestly this card can do pretty much anything now at first i thought having Giannis as my point guard in triple threat meaning the smallest guy was the move but i realized having him as my tallest is even better move because that just allows me to run him at the center position so get two shooters whatever two shooters you're comfortable with i don't have like the best cards on my team but i do have shooters so i'm gonna add these two shooters and we're gonna take them into the game oh i'm playing against zach randolph let's get it but look just so you guys know make sure you watch yesterday's video i'm pretty sure it was yesterday's i don't know the order these videos are coming out 
but pretty sure yesterday the how to make mt that is how i had enough mt to buy Giannis. And I told you guys, make sure you sell everything after just because it makes sense. So right now, you guys are going to see Giannis is playing against the big, but it won't matter at all. Giannis can still defend the big. As soon as he grabs the rebounds, he's literally out and he's pretty much unstoppable. You really can't stop him in the fast break in the open court. You just give him the ball and just get out of his way. You could do euros, hop steps, change it up, just try to dunk it. Pretty much just go anywhere and he's not going to be stopped especially at the center position if you run him at the one or the two you might run into more versatile guys but once you play a big man i realize that he's just so fast that he just becomes a blur and you guys can see that he is tall enough to defend Giannis, there's a reason you have shooters just like milwaukee surrounded you with shooters let's pass him the ball and let's win this game you honestly shouldn't lose a game with this card like it's hard to unless like you run into another Giannis. but other than that He's pretty, pretty effective. You can't really off-ball him or double him. If you do, you just have shooters. Like I said, that's what Milwaukee does. Like, you could really get a triple-double playing this. Like, look at this, man. Downhill, Hall of Fame, quick first step, all that. He gets his takeover, and then it's pretty much easy picking. I know you guys probably wanted to see some unlimited gameplay. I'll try to get you guys that when I get back. I'm not going to have time recording this before I leave. So, for now, just enjoy watching him run to the rim and just show off man i like this game mode because they really be showing off they be doing stuff that they normally wouldn't let's get that rebound five rebounds to go with his 12 points he's got a bunch of bunch of assist possibilities like i could pass the ball every time if i wanted to but it's just so much fun to run to the rim and there's nothing more dangerous than him getting a rebound on one end and running to the other that's just so so dangerous i'm gonna extend this game just a little bit because i like talking i really do enjoy talking and can i get this ball to Giannis? look at that defense man oh my oh my get out my way get out my way gg nothing fancy nice solid easy win against the goat michael jordan why is that the case because Giannis is the real goat let's not forget Giannis put the crown on his head for a reason dude said i'm the greatest and honestly all right let's let's be realistic here i'm gonna be real if Giannis could keep this up i know it's just early he's 24 years old bro if he could keep this up he won mvp last year he's gonna win mvp this year if he keeps up having a consistent jump shot man like dude hit five of eight against the lakers if he can really make it where you can't defend him except like like you really can't defend him type thing bro he's gonna go down as arguably one of the greatest of all times if not the greatest and i'm being for real he does obviously need to win some championships we need to see how that goes because that's how we determine who's the goat and all that but the fact that this guy if you guys look at old videos of him when he came into the league dude was a scrawny kid not even when he came in the league let's look at videos of him when he was in greece man kid wondering if he could play in the nba someday like just talking about his dreams of basketball like that kid becoming one of the goats is not something you would like think possible when you look at a lebron at a young age that was a guy you thought maybe yeah he had the potential to be a goat but Giannis was never that guy that you would ever think yo this guy's gonna be a freak this guy's gonna be an alien and the fact that he is is just beautiful to watch like for real shout out to him it really shows you how hard work pays off if you actually put your mind to something and we're playing against markel Oats, man yo shout out to that kid too bro he was in a bad situation where he was injured in philly nobody thought he was gonna be good again and here he is now doing his thing in orlando and this is looking like one of those assist games because he's being defended really heavily and that's a great thing the fact that people change their scouting report man they double him and all that and then you have two shooters it's honestly like such a beautiful treat to watch and that's how the milwaukee bucks have success so let's keep that in mind Keep that in mind for yourself. Whatever two shooters you do expect to use. I know a lot of people love Lamar Odom. I'm probably going to have to pick him up. I've seen that he's great. He's actually killed me a couple times before I got this Giannis. Now Giannis, I just I just got baby by DeAndre. Usually that doesn't happen because of like the pogo stick and just my ability to jump out the gym. 
with my defensive badges and all that but it's okay we're gonna end up winning this game i'm feeling comfortable usually i feel comfortable unless i run into another Giannis, like i said but at the end of the day i know how i play i know how i roll and i know that we're good regardless my shooter is going bucks right now man that dimer just helping them out they're just shooting lights out and if they're not i'm dunking the ball on the other end you gotta love it yo this is like the most fun i've had playing 2k i'm not even gonna lie i know it's cheesy all this and that but i earned this card you guys can earn this card this card makes the game so much fun i have not spent a dime on my team if anyone was wondering this is straight up grinding straight up playing domination all that to get my first initial mt and from there we have ourselves a Giannis. we still have a good amount of mt for the next hopefully great spotlight challenges you know they're gonna get better it's honestly not possible to get better than Giannis, but this is like an early christmas present and it's early in the year so the fact that that's happening man i can only imagine what we get moving forward i'm not gonna complain i earned this car like i said i'm really having fun with him i hate that i quit and it doesn't count his stats that's the only thing i hate about quitting but it does speed up the process so usually i do rather have like more games played than worrying about my stats but none of that stuff matters right here i'm getting myself my tokens up these are the boards where you worry about tokens and stuff the nt stuff you worry about in the later boards like the threes and the fours that's where you start dropping and hitting a lot of the mt values like the 600s the 500s on the way down and you can be getting over a thousand to two thousand per ball drop that's great but right now i'm just dropping trying to get my tokens up five tokens there and i have one more drop maybe get another five that'll be beautiful i'm gonna go on this side just in case we land on the green but yeah guys let me know if you guys got Giannis. if you're gonna get him what your plans are and if you do how much you enjoy him it sucks because i'm not gonna be able to play 2k for about two weeks and i'm gonna be honest a couple weeks ago if you told me i don't have to play for two weeks i would have been like cool man i don't really enjoy this game anyway that's fine with me but now with this Giannis, i'm really enjoying the game I'm gonna keep playing. I'm gonna play one more and I'm just gonna keep winning, hopefully. Uh oh, David Robinson got a mismatch first play. Great patience by him. He waited till he got the switch that he wanted. But David Robinson, good luck guarding me on the other end, man. Really good luck because I got shooters and dimer. That's all I gotta say. Ooh, got him. Got him with the little hop step, baby. The best part is when they sag thinking I can't shoot, bro. That's a green light, man. I got the. What? Well, that's the two? Bro, that was a three for sure. Ooh! Kobe just 360 that on me. Is this turning into a dunk contest, man? Come on, I got you, bro. I could dunk on the Amro, bro. That's one of the best shot blockers ever of all time, literally. And I just dunked all over him. He's so fast so so fast so last year i started having fun once i got galaxy opal Giannis. i'm already having that type of fun right now man i don't remember when we got galaxy opal Giannis, but this pink diamond Giannis is way too early how do you stop him somebody tell me how do you stop him bro yeah bro you gotta pause there's no way to stop him there is no way to stop him and now he has his takeover good game i'll trade baskets though because i know you're not stopping me you guys can score right back as fast as you want oh man man oh man not nah, yeah oh man oh man the only thing that could possibly make this card more fun for me there's only one thing in the world that would make this card more fun for me than even making that bro just the euro man the euro last year was so unstoppable i wish we had that back i wish we had the euro dunk back I, that's the only thing that would honestly make 2k more fun for me it's not even that i want like the overpowered aspect it's not even like that it's just that it's just the fun animation like i really love the animation of it i love how it looks i love how you catch the other guy slipping like it just makes him look confused it's just a beautiful move to use but yeah guys make sure you let me know if you got Giannis, if you're gonna get him all that good stuff i'm very very interested to know so let me know down low in the comment section if you got him if you're enjoying him if you're going for him let me know if that mt video helped let me know if any of this stuff works out for you guys and enjoy the new crowned greek freak oh bro he's he's i don't i don't know there's so many nicknames you could give him bro call him superman he's so dominant that i know it sounds like i'm slurping him right now but it's really not like that bro he's just so dominant but yeah guys enjoy your holidays enjoy your break enjoy all that i'll see you guys when i get back see you guys later subscribe if you're new leave me a like love you guys balling out